Imagine stepping into the cockpit of tomorrow, where flight feels as natural as driving. That's the experience of the Air One. This futuristic aircraft combines foldable wings with a fly-by-intent joystick, making control simple and intuitive. Its sleek canopy and dual seating turn every flight into a shared adventure. Charging is as easy as plugging in an electric car, blending modern convenience with cutting-edge design. Reaching speeds of up to 155 miles per hour with a range of 110 miles, the Air One isn't built only for adrenaline seekers. It redefines personal aviation, opening the sky to everyday dreamers who want freedom without the complexity of traditional flying. No intimidating pilot's license required, just a desire to explore. The Air One isn't just an aircraft, it's a glimpse of a future where flight belongs to everyone, turning the sky into your open road. Ever dreamed of flying your own personal go-kart in the sky? The Jetson 1 makes that dream real. Lightweight, sleek, and brilliantly intuitive, this single-seat EVTOL combines race car spirit with drone-like agility. Built with a tough aluminum and carbon Kevlar frame, it's powered by eight electric motors that lift you smoothly off the ground. The controls are refreshingly simple, one hand for altitude, the other for direction, meaning you can master takeoff in just minutes. Safety is at the heart of its design. From obstacle detection sensors and an automatic landing system to motor redundancy and a ballistic parachute, every flight feels secure. With a flight time of around 20 minutes, it's not built for cross-country travel, but for pure, adrenaline-packed joyrides above the earth. The Jetson 1 isn't just transportation, it's a glimpse of the future, where flying isn't reserved for pilots but for anyone bold enough to take the controls. Imagine a tiny aircraft that looks and feels like a fighter jet, yet can be built in your own garage. That's the daring spirit of the BBD-5. Sleek, compact, and bold in design, the BD-5 was crafted from fiberglass over aluminum, with a unique pusher engine layout that sets it apart. For those craving even more thrill, the jet-powered BD-5J variant delivered a true pocket jet experience, fast, sharp, and unlike anything else in the skies. This wasn't just an airplane, it was a movement. The BD-5 invited dreamers to not only fly but also build their own aircraft, blurring the line between pilot and creator. While engine challenges and incomplete kits made the journey tough, those who completed it earned more than an airplane, they earned proof of their own persistence and passion. The Bede BD-5 isn't merely a machine, it's a symbol of imagination, ingenuity, and the unstoppable desire to touch the sky on your own terms. This is the Cree Cree MC-15, the world's smallest twin-engine aircraft. At first glance, it looks like a toy, but the moment it takes off, you realize it's a serious machine packed with big performance. Designed in the 1970s by French engineer Michel Colombon, the Cree Cree was built with one mission, to make personal flight as compact and accessible as possible. It runs on two 15-horsepower engines mounted side by side, arranged so that even if one quits, the aircraft remains stable and under control. Its lightweight frame, made from aluminum and foam, allows it to be assembled or disassembled in minutes, small enough to fit in a garage, yet powerful enough to cruise at 120 miles per hour. And with the ability to perform aerobatics up to plus 10 gigaseconds and minus 5, it's as daring as it is practical. The Cree Cree MC-15 proves that sometimes the tiniest aircraft deliver the most unforgettable adventures. Ever dreamed of owning a personal jet? The Subsonics JSX-1 makes that fantasy feel real. This single-seat, single-engine microjet is built for pure excitement. With its compact frame and a turbojet engine tucked just behind your shoulders, every flight feels like strapping into raw power. Unlike heavy military jets, it doesn't overwhelm with noise, it hums with precision, delivering speed in its most personal form. First taking flight in 2011 at Oshkosh with pilot Bob Carlton, the JSX-1 stunned crowds with its agility. From smooth stalls to low-speed passes, it proved that a jet can be both thrilling and approachable. It's not designed for luxury or long hauls. Instead, it captures the essence of flying, fast, direct, and unforgettable. The Subsonics JSX-1 isn't just an aircraft, it's the purest expression of what flight can be a childhood dream reborn as a jet you can call your own. Imagine soaring through the sky in a machine that feels more like a dream than an aircraft. The Open Sky M02J makes that fantasy real. Created by Kazuhiko Hachiya and co-built with aircraft Olympos, 
This tailless jet-powered glider is unlike anything else. It launches with a gentle burst of thrust, climbs for about 10 minutes, then transforms into a silent bird-like glide. Instead of sitting upright, you fly in a prone harness, stretched out above the earth, giving flight a raw, almost poetic intimacy. The frame, built from wood and lightweight composites, strips away the mechanical feel of traditional aircraft. It's not about mass production or speed records, it's about personal connection, blending art with aviation. Each flight feels experimental, fragile, and deeply human, echoing the spirit of imagination that inspired its creation. The Open Sky M02J isn't just an aircraft, it's a fleeting piece of sky you can borrow, a reminder that flight can still feel like magic. Imagine flying an aircraft so small it feels more like wearing wings than piloting a plane. That's the daring spirit of the Stitz SA-2A Sky Baby. Built in 1952 by Ray Stitz, this biplane wasn't about size, it was about audacity. With wings barely 7 feet across and a cockpit that fit like a glove, the Sky Baby demanded absolute precision. Every movement counted, quick, agile, and razor-sharp in response, it turned flight into a high-wire act above the clouds. Though it logged only about 25 hours in the air, its legacy goes far beyond numbers. The Sky Baby proved that aviation isn't always about going bigger, faster, or farther, it's about pushing boundaries in unexpected ways. Now resting at the Udvar Hazy Center, the Sky Baby stands as a timeless reminder that true innovation often comes not from size, but from boldness and imagination. What if the world's smallest biplane could actually take flight? Meet the Star Bumble B2, tiny in size, but massive in ambition. With a wingspan of just 5 feet 6 inches and a length under 9 feet, this record-breaking aircraft looked more like a toy than a plane. Yet beneath its compact frame sat an 85-horsepower Continental engine, giving it surprising power for such a small build. Every detail of the Bumble B2 was crafted to push the limits of what aviation could be. In 1988, it secured the title of the world's smallest piloted biplane, a symbol of human creativity and daring. But the challenge was unforgiving. During one flight, an engine failure at just 400 feet led to a dramatic crash, leaving its creator badly injured but undeterred. The Bumble B2 isn't just an aircraft, it's proof that chasing impossible dreams is what keeps innovation alive, even when the risks are as bold as the vision itself. Imagine owning an aircraft so light, simple, and personal that it feels more like an extension of yourself than a machine. That's the magic of the SD-1 Minisport. This agile single-seater is crafted from wood and composites, keeping it light yet strong. Its detachable wings make storage and transport surprisingly easy, adding a touch of modular adventure to flying. Whether you build it from plans, assemble it from a kit, or order it ready to soar, the Minisport gives pilots the freedom to choose their own path. Cruising at around 160 km per hour, 100 miles per hour, it balances speed with a graceful low-speed performance that feels playful and safe. It's not about heavy controls or complex systems, it's about pure, honest flying. For aviation enthusiasts, the Minisport opens the skies with unmatched affordability and a deeply personal connection to flight. The SD-1 Minisport isn't just an aircraft, it's a smile in the sky, proof that true joy in flying can still come in the simplest form. Imagine riding a motorcycle in the sky, no wheels, no cage, just open air and pure freedom. That's the thrill of the Velonut Airbike. This futuristic machine places you forward like a racer powered by jet turbines that hum beneath your seat. Built from whisper light carbon fiber and crafted with advanced 3D printing, it's seven times lighter than a traditional motorcycle. The design strips away everything unnecessary, leaving only speed, agility, and the wind rushing past. With the ability to weave through forests or slip between urban skylines, it feels more like a scene from science fiction than real life. The airbike can reach speeds close to 124 miles per hour delivering an adrenaline rush unlike anything on the ground. But with just 10 minutes of flight time, it's still more of a bold experiment than an everyday ride. Even so, it pushes the boundaries of what personal transportation could look like in the near future. The Velonut Airbike isn't just a vehicle, it's a daring glimpse into the next era of human flight, where freedom means leaving the road behind.